Recently, OnlineMastheadNews.com, owned by Murdoch News Corp., wrote about an Instagram post the New Zealand boxer and former NRL player shared of his wife Alana Williams and their four young kids. However, in the leading image, the News Corp outlet posted a side-by-side -side of Alana Williams in the hijab, with a photo of her in a gold bikini from her time working in nightclubs, and included an additional picture of her in the costume being held by a male dance partner. Under Islamic faith, women who wear the hijab can only have their hair seen by certain men in their lives, including their husband, relatives, and prepubescent boys. It is therefore insensitive to post or share old photos of a Muslim woman with her hair visible once she becomes a hijab. This is pretty awful, nobody deserves to have images of their past that don't reflect who they are now circulated by a media organization," the ages journalist Najma Sambal wrote on Twitter. It's absolutely creepy behavior toward a Muslim woman. All strength and power to Sonny Bill Williams and his wife Alana who have been ridiculed by News.com for practicing their faith, said Sambal. That article was so wrong on many levels. Palestinian-Australian Hanan Dover wrote on Twitter, the Murdoch media will always be scum. Sonny Bill Williams happily posted about his wife wearing the hijab and they decide to post revealing pictures of her past work before she became Muslim defeating the purpose of women wearing the hijab. Pure scum. Some Muslim netizens also say that Murdoch News Corp's media outlets are vigorously promoting topics such as pornography, racism and prejudice in order to boost circulation, and that unless Murdoch's media operations are brought under control, Australia will go down a path similar to the deep divisions in the United States.